What's up everyone? Corey Parcel Hydro Help 911. Wanted to shoot a quick video again just to show y'all some more um, construction terminology and actually show y'all what we're talking about when we or other contractors use, uh, use some of the words we use. In today's video, we're gonna talk about what is a header. Um, in today's construction, there are headers everywhere. And what a header is, is a big beam that opens a floor plan and it carries the load above an opening. So that opening, as you see behind us, could be this door, or it could be the open floor concept that a lot of people are going to nowadays. So you have this large opening here. Um, there's, uh, there's openings above the windows, headers above the windows um, that carries that weight uh, over the window. And you always have to take that weight and transfer it down somewhere to the ground to a good, good solid foundation. You can't just leave it sitting on top of your floor. So this is something to remember if you live in an older home, 60s, 70s, and you're doing a remodel and you wanna start knocking some walls out, most contractors are gonna know that they have to put a header in. And these headers can be sized differently depending on the span that's needed. So you can see this header right here, they also refer to as a land beam. It's actually a double land beam. Um, the header behind me is, looks to be just a regular two by 12 that the framers made on site. So different headers are different sizes, different heights, depending on the load and how it's engineered. Um, but the one thing we wanna talk about is, is how does that weight get to the floor? So the weight of this header comes over and it transfers down what they call the jack studs and the king studs and it'll, it'll transfer that weight down to the floor, and the house we're in has a basement underneath us, so we're gonna walk down here and take a look at the basement, and we can see how that weight is transferred down to the ground. So you can see here where we was just at, the jack studs and the king studs are pulling that weight down through the floor, and we have more studs underneath us that are gonna transfer that all the way down to the ground. So right above us, again, is where we was at, and you can see everything being pulled down to the ground to make sure that that weight from the upper floor is transferred all the way down through the flooring system above us, down into these balls, and down to the floor. Now, once the sheetrock goes up, this is something we're not gonna be able to see. So you gotta make sure you get inspections done during the framing stage, make sure it's done right. You know, if a contractor comes in years later after your house is built, the only thing they have to go by off of is their experience. Um, and if you have the blueprints, that's always helpful. So again, this is headers. This is, you can see another header right here above me in the basement. Um, it's, it's just to create an opening and that header could be above a, a open floor, above a window or above a door. So if you have any questions, please reach out to us. 704-813-9554. Check us out online at hydrohelp911.com. Y'all have a great day.